Hi, this is Keith from ProTutor, and we have a, an algebra problem here. Um, we have to rate the equation of the line which passes through uh, 2, 1 and is perpendicular to x equals negative 2. Um, okay, so there's two things that we need to be able to do in order to solve this problem. Uh, and the, f the first thing is to be able to write an equation of a line given a point and its slope. So let's just do a quick example. Um, let's say that the slope is 2 and we're looking at the point 3, 2. Um, the way that we find the equation of this line, um, given this, uh, the slope in a point, is we start off with, uh, there's a couple ways we could do it, but the most straightforward way is to start off with um, slope intercept form, y equals mx plus b. Let's insert the um, m equals 2 into, whoa, the m, and then this is your x and y over here, uh, the 3, and I'm going to just use a different color here for the y. And then from there, what we do is we um, just go ahead and make that substitution, and that's going to give you 2 equals uh, 2 times x, which is 3, plus b. And that's going to allow us to solve for um, b. And so we'll subtract 6 from each side, and we find b equals negative 4. Um, what we do then is, is that that means that our equation uh, that passes through this, um, uh, this point with the slope 2 is going to be y equals uh, 2x minus 4. Okay, so that's the first thing. That's the first skill um, that we need to have is um, uh, finding uh, the line with given slope and point. The second thing we need to be able to do is um, uh, be able to find slopes of perpendicular lines. Um, and the, this is really easy. Um, because uh, the, um, the slope of a perpendicular line is always just the negative reciprocal. Um, of the slope. So for instance, if you have m equals 4, then this is going to give us m equals negative 1 fourth in the case of the perpendicular. If let's say we have m equals 1, then this is going to give us m equals negative 1, because the reciprocal of 1 is of course 1, and it needs to be a negative, so m equals negative 1. In the case of uh, m equals 0, which is what we have in this case, then you'd have m equals uh, negative 1 over 0, which is undefined. which means that you actually have um, uh, a perpendicular, a vertical line. Uh, in the case of this guy here, um, will be a horizontal line, um, which is going to be of the form like something like y equals 2, something like this. When it's undefined, it's going to be something in the, like x equals 2, or something like that. Um, OK, those are the two things that we needed to uh, have in place first. So now we have to find the equation of a line that is perpendicular, um, that passes through to 1 and is perpendicular to x equals negative 2. So in this case, we knew that <clears throat> um, it's uh, the slope here is going to be um, uh, m equals um, undefined. So we know that m perpendicular is going to be 0. So from there, what we do is we um, use the uh, slope uh, of 0 along with the point uh, 2, 1 to find the equation of the line. So we'll start off with y equals mx plus b. And then we use, um, just like we did last time, this is our x and y. Uh, so this guy um, is going to go here, the 2 and the 1. 
and then the m. That's going to give us 1 is equal to 0 times 2 plus b, and 1 equals b. Um, this is going to give us, then we have um, the equation y equals 0x plus 1, or y equals 1. And that's our answer. Uh, we hope this has been helpful, and as always, if you have any additional questions, please just let us know. Uh, this has been Keith from ProTutor. Thanks.